So, regroupy. Regroupy is one of our more popular games with essential maths. It's a really good game because it allows children to practice column addition in a really safe and fun way. It focuses on um, common errors such as regroups or we used to call them exchange. Also, you can really get children to think quite deeply about numbers in a fun way. So, regroupy, what will you need? You will need a pack of cards, a friend, something that can be used as tokens. I'm using Cheerios, which I'm trying to not eat, and some pencil and paper for jottings. Right, how do you play? First thing you have to do is take your pack of cards and take out all the kings, the queens and the tens. Jacks will be the digit zero and aces are worth one. Once your cards are ready and you've got ready your kings, your queens and your tens, give the pack a shuffle and then deal eight cards to each player. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Once each player has got their cards, they then arrange them into two four digit numbers set up like a column addition. Okay, so when everyone has got their cards set up like this, then they can turn them over. And this is where the thinking really starts to begin. Because what you need to do in order to win regroup is win as many tokens as you can. You get tokens in two different ways. Firstly, by getting the greatest total out of everyone who's playing, you get one token for that. Secondly, you get two tokens for every regroup that you, can, that you have in your calculation. A regroup is what we used to call an exchange. So for example, 600 plus 600 is 1,200. So that's a regroup into the thousands column. So that would get me two Cheerios. However, it's not as simple as just putting big number and big number because you are not allowed to go over 9,999. In other words, you can't trigger that final column here. So, I've got to sit here and really think about these cards. Okay, so now I think I've arranged my cards into the best scoring hand possible. So I've got 6,990, 2,610. I'm going to add those two together. So I've got 0 plus 0 is 0. I've got 9 tens and 1 ten which makes 10 tens, which is 100, which is a regroup. So I get two Cheerios for that. And then I have 900 plus 600 plus my 100 regroup, which is 1,600. That's another regroup, so I get another two Cheerios for that. And then I have 6,000 plus 2,000 plus 1,000, which is 9,000. So it's not illegal. I haven't gone over 9,999. Very close, but I'm not there. So I've got four Cheerios for my two regroups. The question is, will I get another Cheerio for having the greatest total amongst all of my friends? 